Is it weird to install cameras in a teenager's room? I'm 16 and I have two cameras installed in my room. Edit I've never done anything illegal in my life, and the camera is not there to check if anyone comes in or anything like that, it's also not related to CP, it's mainly there for my parents to keep track of my work and sleep schedule, and my main question was in this context is it weird? My parents used to have a camera in my room. They took my door's key too. I had no privacy at all. They only took the camera down when my uncle talked to them but it was there for about half a year maybe. I can't remember. To answer your question. Yes. Yes, it is weird. More than weird. Get someone to talk to them about it if you can't convince them. Someone that would make them feel guilty if it comes to that. You're a teenager and you need privacy. There's nothing wrong with it. That's one way to make sure you have no relationship with your kids as adults. In my country that is illegal. If it's not illegal where you're at, they are still insane. Your parents need a mental check no joking. That isn't weird that is bad shit insane. Yes. That's borderline abuse and I'm not even sure it's legal. Also, TWO cameras in your room? Do you think this is acceptable? Weird? Mate, it's an absolute violation of privacy. Yes, extremely weird. Whoever is watching you has a mental illness and an obsession with control, even if they are nice. Not any person needs a camera installed into their child's room unless they have a medical condition. Your privacy is being invaded. Cut some black electrical tape to fit over the camera's lenses. When they ask why you did that, tell them that you're protecting them from being prosecuted for making child pornography, and that if they have any questions about what you do in your room, they should ask you directly. This is seriously crazy. I'll save everyone some time and say this. Yes. Yes. That means your parents doesn't trust you enough or are one of those helicopter parents. My mom isn't the best parent but at least she doesn't install CCTVs on my room or has to keep tracking on wherever I go. Soon you will be able to move out. Very. That sounds extremely weird. In my country I think that would be a crime. Yeah this is honestly insane. It's way past weird and bordering on abusive. How to push your kids away from you 101. I try my absolute best to give my kids as much freedom that is logically safe for them, would never do this to my kid. With that being said, I do have a camera in my two-year-old's room. He's very autistic and it's more for safety let us know if he wakes up in middle of the night. Talk to your school counselor, a social worker, or any trusted adult. Don't ask random internet stranger, but yeah it's weird as hell. What are they hoping to see? Not sure of your gender from the comment but regardless, teenagers need to explore and discover their own bodies in the privacy of their own rooms without feelings of guilt or shame. I seriously don't care what the culture is, this is beyond weird it's actually sick. That's 100 child abuse. On all accounts, under all circumstances, yes. Go ahead and let your parents watch you masturbate to gay porn. That should end it. This is a violation of your privacy and a form of emotional and psychological abuse. Any culture or society can normalize or minimize abusive strategies, but that doesn't make them any less trauma-producing. They are still abusive behaviors rooted in power and control over you, to keep you compliant and afraid. If you live in the States you can, report it to a school counselor, as they are mandated reporters. It's not your job to protect your parents from the consequences of their own actions. It's actually their job to protect you from abuse and trauma. Very weird, an invasion of privacy and just the wrong way to parent. Ah, that is absolutely fucking insane and completely invasive. Are they pedophiles, or just crazy paranoid and untrusting? Literally only two options. Are you a baby? 
Do you need them to come running into your room the moment you start crying? If not the answer is no that's just wrong plain and simple. You have to talk to your parents about this in a calm manner and just say it makes you very uncomfortable. No matter what they say your room has that only little bit of privacy reserved for yourself. It's abuse because 24-7 surveillance is psychologically exhausting. Even if they love you and you trust them, the lack of privacy downtime is going to affect your health eventually. Yes. Our insane parents. It's perverted. Yes. Yes that's deranged. I was talking to some adult chick who said her dad has cameras in her apartment. Turns out she has unspecified mental problems and easily lets anyone come home with her. I'm not saying you have mental problems, but is there anything you do that your parents would be totally against? Yes 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 it is very weird and or psychotic. What the hell is wrong with them? It's a form of abuse. That's fucking mental. Completely in sans. You're entitled to your own privacy. Yes it's weird and of what country you live in. Yes. It's child abuse. If they don't take them down, threaten to masturbate in your room and report them for child pornography. Utterly unacceptable. Once you're 18 or out of the house, your parents are going to wonder why you don't speak to them. I can imagine this is one of those reasons, but yeah it's fucked. Take a picture of your room and tape it in front of the camera. Also yeah that's weird. Maybe don't jerk off in your room anymore. Or do it all the time, I'm not the boss of you. That's a no-go. Past the age of being in a crib no cameras unless the kid has some issues mentally or with self-harm etc. Ask them straight up where am I supposed to masturbate? Nope. Not okay. It's a false sense of control for the parent. In reality, it teaches their kid to subconsciously always feel like they are being monitored and need to watch their behavior actions, it's a shitty feeling and no parent should honestly thoughtfully think their kid deserves to feel that way 24-7. These parents just do not understand the position they are putting their kids in, and are being selfish as doing this makes them feel like they are in control. It's shitty behavior and results in the kid feeling shitty too. Yeah that's fucked up. Make sure your parents aren't making child porn or something. If you brought this up with a counselor, they might call CPS. Yes, it's weird and it's creepy. I know a guy who put a camera outside his daughter's bedroom. Pointing at her door. She would sneak out in the middle of the night, and he got an alert on his phone when it detected motion. Nothing weird about that. Because the hallway isn't a private space, and her bedroom isn't a private space if the door is open and the camera can see in, since she could always close the door. Just start rubbing one out five times daily to assert dominance. As a parent. It's not weird. It's straight up insane to install cameras in a teenager's room. Where are your human rights here? I'm sure a human right is being entitled to privacy. What the f dude? If that was me at your age I'd take a baseball bat to the cameras just for the disrespect. The worst you could get was a beating and I'd take that over having cameras in my room any day. There's a very high chance that there's footage of you naked in the room, which I think can be considered as producing having child, so if you wanna get back at them, a single call to the cops could get them jailed I think. Yes, that is invasion of privacy and would be totally illegal in Europe. I am pretty surprised if it is not illegal in your area. Tell your parents to install cameras in their bedroom that you can watch and stream if you wish to. That's not weird that's fucked up. Absolutely. I can't fathom any reason that would make it okay. Weird is often a matter of cultural context. But that sounds instursive and not comfortable at all. That is weird, abusive, toxic, morally wrong, unethical, not allowed, detrimental to trust and mental health, you name it, it is wrong. Please, could you talk to a trusted adult or counselor about this? This is fucked up beyond belief.